Boom, one last turn with the sun. Scavillain for the win. You already know, baby, it's time to set up the sun. Fun in the sun, let's get the drought nice and high in the sky. Torkoal, we're gonna switch out. I don't wanna risk an earthquake there. They actually elect to go for Stealth Rock instead, and they go for Iron Defense, which is kind of interesting. Our Fortress is not running Rapid Spin. I don't wanna give them any sort of extra defense. We're just gonna set up all of the hazards here with our lovely little Fortress. So I'm gonna set up the Toxic Spikes. I know that they do have the Toxtricity, which is going to get rid of the Toxic Spikes in due time, but I still just kinda want it out there just to kinda linger in their mind. They go for the Body Press with the Critical Hit that does clear off half, which sucks a lot. But it is what it is, Body Press is going to kill our Fortress, but I don't know really why they're going for this Iron Defense, it's fine, it's just going to get blown away by our Scavillain, baby, Overheat, Terra in the Sun, and that's going to kill anyone, that was a rhyme, I didn't mean it, but eh, maybe I did. Toxtricity comes out, clears the spikes, it's fine. We go for the overheat, we're still Terra'd with the stat drop, and we still get the kill. How great is that? Was that another rhyme? Either way. Gyarados. Okay, so Gyarados is going to blow our armor <laughs> out of the water. It is what it is, sorry buddy. They do get the Moxie, it's a, kind of a rough spot here. Hopefully they're not Scarf. We go for the Dragon, we're going to go for a Double Shock. It's still going to do a decent amount of damage, but unfortunately they do Terra into the Dragon, and now they've got double Moxie up here. The only way we're going to be able to take out this pesky little Gyarados, we're going to set up the sun. That waterfall is still going to kill us even in the sun because they're moxie. Now we go with the Scovillain, baby. Pepper power is nothing. Gyarados is going to go down. We have, the, we have the Terra in the sun. It's over. So, oh my goodness. The Armor Rouge. We're going to go for the Flamethrower to kind of test the waters here. They go for the Calm Mind. I was thinking maybe they would just kill us and we could Dragon Dance with our Iron Thorns, but they're a Calm Mindset, and that is <laughs> no bueno, that is not good. So, thankfully, they do go for Calm Mind again, and we're just gonna outspeed. So that is actually wonderful, because that could've got scary really quickly. I wasn't expecting that Calm Mindset there. Haxorus, I'm assuming, is gonna just go ahead and Earthquake us. Ah, it does kill. Yeah, we are pretty bulky, but it does kill anyway. Now, here comes the Scovillain with 26%. We drop the Overheat, and in the sun, there's only two more turns. One more turn with the Stealth Rock. I was, ooh, with the Sash, even if it is Sash, it goes with that. Boom, one last turn with the sun. Scovillain for the win. Is the Skull Villain the hero or the villain? I don't know, but it's really cool to play, I'll tell you that much. Torkoal's coming out, and the Mouse Hole, they go for U-Turn, which is nice, because I'm expecting that Population Bomb. And we're going to go for the Lava Plume. Get the burn, burn, burn. All right, no burn, it's okay. We are packing Earth Power. Ooh, no, it's not enough to kill. We are packing Solar Beam here, but we actually don't go for it. Let's go for the Fortress. I want to get the Stealth Rocks up. Free damage is also wonderful. Gastrodon, let's see what we can do here. They're gonna go for Earth Power, that's fine. I guess we can kinda just commit to the spikes. I know they have that Don fan, they're gonna get rid of our hazards here. But I want them to at least be a little nervous about it. So they go for the Earthquake, let's go for the Skull Villain. I'm just tired of messing around here. They're gonna go for Salamance, let's see what we can do here. Let's go ahead and just get some damage. Energy Ball, that's a double resistant for the Salamance, which really sucks. But it is what it is. We still have, we can still Terra, and we go for the Overheat, and then it's going to kill. Terra Overheat Skavillain. I mean, with the Life Orb, it kills anything. You resist it? I don't care. It's in the sun. We're having fun in the sun. Thunder Wave. Get, get out of here. Just get out of here, Klefki. We don't care. We're at like 33 times special attack right now. It does not matter, especially in the sun. Don Fan. Okay, now we're a little bit nervous. I want to get rid... Okay, we have to save our Skavillain here because we need the Grass type for the Gastrodon and the Don Fan, but... It's gotta be kinda hard, and they actually give it up, that's actually really good for us, cause that rapid spin was kind of annoying. And we go for the gyro ball, which is actually pretty cool. They go for beat up, and this is really good, cause we, I mean, Fortress has so much physical bulk here. We go two gyro balls down, and I kinda like gyro ball, not a lot of people run it on their Fortress here, but I really like it. That fire punch, not gonna lie, I never run fire punch on my palm lot, but they do, and we go down, it is what it is. I'm gonna go ahead and just go for a little bit of poke damage. This sucks though, because now we have to switch out because we are choice scarfed on our armor rogue. So, Torkoal goes down, but his sacrifice will not be in vain because the sun is loud, proud, and in the sky. We've got the Scovillain, and we missed the Leaf Storm. Of course we missed the Leaf Storm, but it is what it is. No, it's okay. It's okay. We'll be fine. We've got our own Palma. We're not running Fire Punch, but we are running Revival Blessing. We're gonna go ahead and get that back in the crit. Did that matter, the crit? Probably not, but the crit does kind of burn a little bit. But it's not going to burn as bad as a Scovillain, baby. This is so good. Energy Ball, we're going to make up for lost causes. We don't get the Terra type anymore, but the Paw Mott, no, it's, it's going to be okay. Boom, Flash, Fire, baby! That Fire Punch ends up getting them 
armor cannon in the sun. You have got to love it. And they give it up. Let's go. This team looks super interesting here. They got, they're going to start with their Screamtail. I'm actually going to go with our Iron Thorns because if we start off with our Torkoal, we don't want to see that Sandy Shocks. So I'm going to go for Iron Thorns first just to be play on the safe side. They're going to go for their Gyarados. Intimidate. That's fine. Let's go for another Dragon Dance. And they tear into Flying. That's okay. So... Oh, we actually just get the kill, even with the reflect up. They're not four times, they are two times, and they just give it up. Okay. All right, baby, round two. Let's see what we got. We got the Torkoal. They're going to leave with their Salamence. I never really liked that, because I never really know if the Salamence is just dropping a Draco, doing a Dragon Dance, what they're doing. They go for a Dragon Claw, which seems pretty good, all things considered. Our Fortress is going to take those physical moves. I'm going to switch out. I'm a little nervous of a Fire Fang, which, there it is. Eh, it is what it is. We're going to go with our Overheat, because I, I just, I don't really know. We're just going to try and get some damage off to the Salamence. I don't know what they are got going on here. They're obviously not choicing anything. It was okay, though, because we have our Iron Thorns. We're going to set up for a little bit of dance action. This Gastrodon, with our Cork Drive attack, I think we might be okay. Our Earthquake does break half, and they go, ooh, for Clear Smog. That's going to clear away our attack buff, and I think we may not be able to. Okay, so here's the thing. They go for Recover, so they're losing 8%. We go for Earthquake. They do a little damage, but we still have that Quark Drive. I think we're still going to win. If we go for Dragon Dance and just keep going... Okay, so they know that. They switch out. So we go for another Dragon Dance, and now we can at least kill the Selamance. Let's go Wild Charge. It is what it is. Let's get it, baby. So now the Gastrodon is no good against us. So Haxorus, let's go ahead and just tear it into the Stone Edge. And of course we miss. And of course they're Dragon Dancing too. They go for another Dragon Dance. We're going to go for a Stone Edge. They have a Sash. Oh my word. It's okay. We do have a way to deal with this. We do have one priority attacker on our team. It is the Palma, and that is going to be what we have to do. So we do have the Mock Punch. Boom. Let's get that thing out of there because that could have been, been game, honestly. We, we don't have a whole lot of priority on here. But, Palma with the Lepaberry. Let's go for the Revival. They're going to recover. That's fine, because we have the Scavillain coming back from the dead. Ah, uh, they're not dead. They're just fainted. They're just fainted. So, Ice, ice Beam, whatever. Ice Beam, we're going to go into our Armor Roach here. I'm actually going to go for Trick. We actually cannot really, um... Oh! Oh! So, they have, st wait, they have Sticky Hold rather than Storm Drain? Oh, okay. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and go for our Fortress here. That's so that Surf's not going to do a whole lot. Uh, let's go ahead and set up some spikes. Let's go ahead and just put some pressure on the Gastrodon if they leave. We, we can at least clear them with something else. I know we're going to get sucked up with the Fortress. It is what it is. This Thunderbolt, no, it does actually kill us in one shot, which really sucks. Well, let's go ahead and set up that beautiful sun that we love so much. We are going to lose a Torkoal, but I don't think we're actually going to need anything else. So we have got the Scovillain. Flamethrower, baby. This is Prime Pepper time. Let's go. Pepper power to the max. Uh, I can't ever say that. Pichirizu, it doesn't even matter. It's gone. Who cares? You stupid Pikachu ripoff. And they just give it up. Let's go.